그때는 그 입양이 된 다음에 이제 영주권자로서 입국을 하고 아, 18살 전에 시민권 신청을 했어야 돼요. 보통 이제 입양 부모가 해요. 그렇게. They asked Tom about it. Uh, he told me uh, he doesn't know. And then when we get in a big fight about it, he says uh, it was not his responsibility. He said that the people before me, the rights, the first family was supposed to do it, and it's not his fault. Me getting citizenship was the farthest thing from his mind. That's why I got in trouble the first time, because I broke in their home after I'm out on the street when I'm 17, just to get my um, Korean Bible and my Korean shoes that came with me from uh, the orphanage, and uh, one stuffed animal. And... 내가 어디서 왔고 누구였는지 말해주는 유일한 증거들이었습니다. 내 소중한 물건을 찾으려 했을 뿐인데 나는 25개월을 감옥에서 보내야 했습니다. I never got anything that I had from Korea back. Nothing. 하지만 전과자라는 꼬리표는 내 인생을 올감했습니다. He had asked his parents several times, you know, to 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 get these things back and they refused and so he broke into the house and his um adoptive mom Dolly uh, pursued, you know, this prosecution of him for having broken into first degree burglary, which um, was an aggravated felony under immigration law. It, it didn't matter that it was my adoptive parents' home. It didn't matter. All that mattered was that that conviction was on my record. And so it would just say burglary one, class A felony. So that would automatically put me in removal proceedings right there, just that one.